All right, hello everybody. This is Caribbean HRD TV, and we are speaking with Yolanda Hilton about talent management. Ms. Hilton is doing her DBA, and this is the focus of her study. She's also studying small and medium-sized businesses in Jamaica, so one day we'll speak with her about that. But right now we're focusing on talent management. And given that this is the Caribbean, we're always a little bit unique. So I asked her if she has any tips for how Caribbean organizations can manage their talent. All right. Thank you so much for that question. And I'm going to give you possibly an unorthodox answer, a Caribbean-based answer. I know people here, performance management, and I can hear the grows and the rolling eyes, especially when you think about performance, we traditionally just think about the performance appraisal uh, aspect of it. But the reality is that performance management is a process. And if we are to take performance management as a process seriously, it will help us to manage our talent. So it's not supposed to be just a form filling exercise. It is not supposed to be painful. It is something that is beneficial for the individuals if it includes an individual development plan. It also benefits the employer and it, it benefits the employer from all standpoints of the employee life cycle. So if we do performance management properly, it advises us if we are recruiting the right type of persons, recruiting and selecting the right type of persons, it will inform us what gaps exist. Do we need to be providing training? And so training doesn't just benefit the organization, but it helps the individual to hone their talent. And persons right now want, pers want employers to be investing in them as they focus on career development. Performance management process includes coaching. Now, when we think about coaching, you think about sports. And I love athletics. And at the end of the race, irrespective of where you are from, or let's go back to Jamaica and think about Shelly or Elaine, Asaf, or you saying they all thank their coach. Yes. You're going to thank God and you're going to thank your coach. And it speaks to the relationship that is built. So I'm willing to listen to what you have to say because you are going to guide me. You have my best interests at heart. And if you have my best interests at heart, I will move mountains for you. And so coaching allows you to develop that genuine relationship. Now, sometimes persons, you know, struggle, especially as leaders, to find the time for coaching. But finding that time is critical to building that one-on-one -on -one relationship as each individual has different needs. And we can't or we shouldn't use one paintbrush to paint everybody. And sometimes we are a little guilty of that in the Caribbean where you know, um, we want to encourage persons, we decide to have a pizza party or we think you can just raise the pay and that will be it. But honestly, people have different needs. So if you have that one-on-one -on -one time, you can find out what that is. It helps you with succession planning. So if you do the individual development plan, I may be good at, at um, data entry in my day-to-day -day job, but my aspiration is for something completely different. If I manage it properly, I can assist in honing those skills and it may be skills that the company will require later on. And again, once you're feeding into people, they will give you back that that uh, that love. And so it leads to retention. So if we think about performance management as the foundation to managing talent, it helps us to attract the right people, recruit and select the persons that we need, it helps us to identify where training is needed. It helps us with succession planning. And it helps us to manage our relationships. And once you are doing that, it will help the organization to be successful. All right. Thank you so much. Quite a mouthful. No, but I the bottom line is that this is crucial. Talent management <laughs> crucial. is crucial in organizations that want to be successful. Of course. All right. So thank you so much, Yolande. Thanks a million. No.